Today, I will be demonstrating the Color Image Import Tool, a new feature in version 7. In this video, I will use this tool to generate the parts to make a Betsy Ross flag from a color image. I'll start by navigating to the source image. I'll resize the image to fit well on a 24 inch square sheet. Now I'll change the color tolerance parameter to a value that produces more accurate geometry. The software will analyze the image and break it into different color groups. In this case, the tool has converted the image into four layers, white stripes, red stripes, stars, and the star field. I'll name them to avoid confusion. I want the stars to be cutouts of the blue field, not individual parts, so I'll move them to the correct layer by selecting them and changing active layers. I can then delete the unused stars layer. I also want my white layer to be a base on which to mount the other pieces. Currently, this layer is just the stripes. I'll select and delete these, and draw a rectangle over the image's full area. The parts are finished, so I'll head into the cam module. I can't cut these pieces stacked on top of each other, so I'll distribute them across the material with the nest. Now, I'll move to the CNC module where you can see that the program is ready to run. The Color Image Import tool is a powerful and easy way to bring signs, logos, and even drawings into the version 7 software.